Hi, sorry. I know, I know I'm late. I'm so sorry. I stopped by this little cafe. I thought I'd get us some iced coffee. You know, figure we might need like a little energy boost. I, hmm, <laughs> I hope you do actually drink coffee. <laughs> I mean, oh, come to think of it, I don't know if I've even seen you drink coffee before. <laughs> I'm sorry, I should have asked. You know, I just had this major caffeine craving and since it's about a thousand degrees outside, I figured this would do the trick. Really? Oh. Well, <laughs> I mean, you can try it if you want to and if you don't like it, I can assure you I can probably drink yours too. <laughs> yes. Oh, thank you. Yeah, sure. Your place is nice. Mm hmm. Oh, please. Mine does not look anywhere close to this. Not at all. Yeah, but you know, all dorm rooms are small. <laughs> Should we sit right here? Great, awesome. So you didn't actually specify what you wanted to work on. I mean, I know organic chemistry, but that's a really wide topic. Everything, <laughs> okay, very, um, very helpful. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, well, um, you said your last test didn't go that great. Would you mind showing me? If you have it, we can go over it and we can see, you know, what you did really good at and what you want to work on. That is not true. Hey. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm serious. Do you know how many people had to retake that test? It's really difficult. I mean, if you don't want to show it to me, I can just take some examples from your book, but I think it could really help. Okay, um, <laughs> what kind of confession? Oh, um, okay, so is it much lower than you told me? Mm. Why didn't you just tell me? I would never think that, first of all, because of one test. Honestly, I don't think, I wouldn't think that even if you were failing on 50 tests or something. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we all have topics where we excel, right? And those where we really don't. <laughs> I mean, for example, you should never ask me anything about geography. Or physics. Let's not even get into that. I failed my first semester taking physics. I had to retake it. And then I actually had to take the last test twice before I passed. But, you know, I did it. And you can do this too. I promise you. Well, that is exactly why I'm here. To help. I'm not here to judge and I'm not here to come down on you. I just... I want to help. Because I managed to pass my physics because I had... Because I had someone that really believed in me. And I know what it's like when 
you have people that don't believe that you can do something. And it's even worse when that person is yourself, when you don't have anyone there to to motivate you or to cheer you on or to have faith in you. I want to help you prove yourself wrong. <laughs> prove that you can actually do this because I know you can. You are a lot smarter than you think. <laughs> now, come on, show me the paper. Please. Okay, well, <laughs> this is not that bad. Yeah, I mean it. Okay, and I think this will be a good start, actually. Because, you know, hybridization is a really big one that you really need to understand if you want to pass this. Mm -hmm. So, do you remember the general rule? If you want to calculate the number of hybridized orbitals, you have to take the number of attached atoms plus the number of lone pairs. Now, I prefer to draw. <laughs> that just makes it a lot easier if you have a visual. So if you look at this molecule right here, this oxygen is holding hands with two carbons. <laughs> I like the analogy, okay? Don't make fun of me. <clears throat> now, how many lone pairs does this molecule have? Good, and remember the rule? Okay, so 2 plus 2 equals 4. <laughs> See, I told you, you totally got this. Mm-hmm. I believe in you. What? <laughs> that look. What does that look for? <laughs> you don't need to thank me for that. I mean, everyone deserves to have someone that believes in them. Well, now you do. <laughs> okay, then, um, then you're welcome, I guess. You know, you're really cute when you blush. No, I'm talking about that waffle iron. Yes, <laughs> of course I'm talking about you. I mean, you... <laughs> to be honest, you always look... Sorry. I'm... <laughs> I have a habit of making things... awkward. <laughs> I'm making you uncomfortable, aren't I? I'll shut up. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did mean it. I wasn't, I wasn't just being nice. I really... I really like you. I know we don't know each other that well, but... <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying this, but... <laughs> I've had a crush on you since... forever. Because... <laughs> I don't know, I'm... I'm kind of shy, and I just figured... I'm really different from... from the girls that you used to date. Uh, 
Uh, yeah. How how wide is my grin right now? <laughs> just just asking on a scale of one to ten. Okay, eleven. Yeah. Well, if you <clears throat> if you wanted to make it even bigger, I think you should ask me out. Really? This is so unexpected. I mean... <sighs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <sighs> I told you I'm the expert of making things awkward. <laughs> yeah, you can. You can kiss me. Anytime. 